assisted by number nine, Patrick Coyle. And Hughes, the freshman, was left wide up on the far side by the Elizabethtown defense as he found the space, fired that one home quickly, and now with 12.06 to go in the third quarter, Washington extends their lead as they lead Elizabethtown by a score of 4-1 to as the freshman Hughes picks up his fifth goal of the season. He's got a very good shooting percentage, does Hughes. Five goals now on the season for him. He was four goals for eight shots coming in. He picks up the goal. Coyle now has two assists on the afternoon, and Washington now has another possession. As inside here comes Trap, and Trap shoots and scores! What a dirty play there by Michael Trapp as he scoops up the face off. Came all the way inside, all the way to the cage. Nobody from Elizabethtown bothered to pick him up. He somehow wound up finding himself one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender Corcoran. And Trapp finds the back on that for the goal for the Shoreman. And now with 11.57 to go in the third quarter, two quick goals by Washington. They lead Elizabethtown by a score of 5-1. And a whistle now and a timeout taken by the Blue Jays as Trapp... Again, just took that face off, sprinted all the way up the field with it, and snuck it past the goaltender Corcoran. Two goals for the Shoreman in the last nine seconds gives them a 5-1 lead, and the timeout is called on the field. We'll step aside as well. 11.57 left now to go in the third quarter. Washington now leads Elizabethtown 5-1 on Goose Nation TV, presented by the Showman Club.